it is our last full day in the park. But we have got a massive list to get on with, haven't we? So everyone's down at breakfast. We're not going to be there for quite opening, just a little bit after. But we're all a bit tired. But we need a bit of rest behind us to get into this list today. So we are going downstairs for a coffee, wake ourselves up and get ready to smash out this list. I want to eat loads yeah. and ride loads. Yeah, that's our list. I'm trying to cram in as much as possible. Yeah, we've got a few shows because we haven't done any shows yet. Oh yeah, that'd be good. It's a bit colder today. I've got my thermal leggings on underneath my jeans today. I've got mine in my bag just in case. Yeah, it's not freezing. Just no. Just being being on the safe side there. But then when you're outside all day, it, you do feel the cold a little bit. So, we'll right. see. Let's go meet him for breakfast and then get on that bus. Sun is coming up, are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow. Your will is my law, I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go with you. Looks quite foggy this morning. Might clear up in a bit, it's still early yet. Hello, good morning everybody. So Vicky's gone with the messy brioche bun and I'm just having toast tea and a pan of chocolate. So we've just had some breakfast, which is quite nice, but outside there's an actual bus waiting. We're all ready and we're waiting on Nick and Lee, so it looks like we're going to miss that one. And then the next one is 10.18, so we've only got like 15 minutes to wait. It's not too bad. Honestly, if you're thinking about staying in this dream castle, I'd highly recommend it. It's just amazing. Absolutely stunning. Never seen anything dirty, out of place. It is beautiful. You've missed the bus. I've discovered it just pulled off. It may be worth missing it. I've got some of Okay. So as I was saying, definitely worth staying here again, isn't it? Yeah, it's beautiful. The, really nice. The only downfall is the buses. They there's only one bus for four hotels on this strip. So it's the only downfall of staying here, but otherwise this hotel is excellent. They're pretty frequent in the morning though. It's just on a night they're pretty packed, but such a clean modern hotel, isn't it? Like, yeah. if you like walking, it's only half an hour walk. Oh yeah, I mean there's a mixture of people in the group that you know some want to walk, some don't. So it's, we're just waiting for the bus. Yeah. And with my feet being sore the way they are, I'd rather get the bus as well today. Might but yeah, the right walk here. it's it's fine if you don't mind walking. It's only like what did you say, 20, 25 minutes? Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, definitely gonna stay here again. Absolutely love this hotel. Yeah, it's very magical. You feel like you're in a Disney hotel, but you're not. Yeah. So yesterday we were debating uh, what to have for a snack last night in the hotel, and we really wanted pizza, but we didn't get any. No. Anyway, Nick's just gone past somebody's bedroom, and outside was a pizza box with the Dreamcastle logo on. Oh really? So, yeah, we've just asked at reception, and apparently it's room service only for pizza. Oh. So all this wanting a pizza and we didn't end up with one. Oh, minute. Anyway, we've got one night left. If we want pizza tonight, we might order one. Maybe. Right, only four minutes till the next bus and everybody's here. No walking this morning. Oh, blimey, it's wet out here. It's rained. Didn't bring my poncho with me. So the brolly's out. The rain is continuing. It's not heavy, heavy, but it's it's not stopping. No, it's just the light stuff that wets you. So, so we're just going into the Walt Disney Studios first. I think we need to do some shows in here, don't we? Yeah, we want to see the Mickey show. And we want to go to the Marvel area to do. I can't remember what ride it is. The old Aerosmith. Uh, Flight Force. That's amazing. And I think Faith wants to do RC Racer again. I think so. a miss. But yeah, so we're back here in Walt Disney Studios with this lovely rain and I'm walking in about two music's playing nothing better really all right so first show animation celebration this is the frozen show so looking forward to this one okay so we're just going through into the I think it's like the holding room before we go into the theater wow <laughs> oh look wooden stairs this doesn't look so comfy Ah, Sven. Might sit on kids' seats, isn't it? I won't be falling asleep on here. No, it's not that comfy. <laughs> I was expecting some absolutely massive theatre, but it's just a really small stage with not much seating. 
Oh, sorry, Sven. No carrots. But Christoph, you promised! Reindeers are better than people. Sven, don't you think that's true? Dear people of Arendelle, welcome! L'hiver s'installe doucement dans la nuit. So as you come out of the Frozen show, you come into the Art Academy. So they're on little Mickey tables. So basically, there's a cast member at the top drawing some a Disney character, and then he'll show you how to draw it on the little machine. It's really cool. They're currently drawing Tigger, but I don't know if you can see. So there is a little shop over here. It used to be full of artwork, but I'm not sure what's in it now. So we're gonna go have a look. Right, so review on the show. Well, we had kind of expected it was gonna be a bit like the one in Hollywood Studios. Nah. So you to go. To be honest, I thought it was. It was terrible. Crap. So you go into one room, and then so you, you're all sat on your seats. They do about like a five, seven minute show in there, and then you all get up, and then you move into another theatre and but, watch the second part because yeah. it's set up ready for you. But we were all sat on the front row, so Faith could see. And so when we moved into the next theatre, a load of people just jumped in the front. So we all had to scatter about so we couldn't get where we all sat before and then we couldn't all sit together. Which is a bit disappointing for somebody who needs the front row to be able to see better. Like, I just found just people pushing and being rude, like, for God's sakes, just get up and sit in the next room where you're meant to sit. So it was a bit frustrating that way because, I yeah. mean, you can still see from where we were, but for people who need to use the front row, yeah. just be careful of that. Like. And we thought it'd be more like 50-50 French and English split, but it's not, it was like 75 French. It was, it was, it was all right. It was I just all right. I expected got, more. Kids would probably enjoy it more than we did. Yeah. But that's a definitely a Florida one. Paris yeah. Zero. And also, we have found the French quite rude on this trip, haven't we? The cast members don't seem as happy as they are when you go to the States. No, we went and we went and did Meet Mickey, and one of the characters there was exceptionally happy, and it's the only one we've met this whole trip exceptionally happy. And he said to his colleague, when he was saying, I love working for Mickey, and he said to his colleague, do you like working for Mickey? And she went, She's like, it's all right, he pays me at the end of the day. And that is the general gist of the cast members here. So I'm a bit disappointed in that. Because in Florida, everyone is exceptionally happy and it's what you go for, the atmosphere. That's part of the magic of yeah. the experience. And everyone here just seems to be like, where the, the they can say more on in and you here. just don't get much back to you. Yeah. So, yeah. Don't mean to sound so negative. So let's go be a bit positive, eat some snacks and do some rides. Yes. Right, so just in the corner, we've got scream, mon scream monitors. Come on. So you scream into this, uh, into this. Compared to Nick. <laughs> right, Tracy's having a go. <laughs> Not quite to the top there. Come on, Faith. <laughs> go on, Vic, you got it up high. Vic, give it a go. <laughs> Sorry for laughing over that, that was quite funny. Right, so we're back to Avengers Campus. Absolutely love this place. I think we wanna we wanna go to the Stark Cafe for some food we've seen and also go on a few more rides while we're back here. So that's Pim's kitchen where we ate yesterday. Like I say, I recommend that, it was brilliant. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go on Avengers Assemble Flight Force. God, I can't get used to that. The old rock and roller coaster. 
So what do you think of that? Oh, I love it. That's mint, that ride. Yeah, it is. It just threw your head around a bit, that yeah. one. If you hold on to the straps and you push your head back, you don't seem to rock as much. Yeah, but it just throw you around. Uh, and also, my, it, my speakers didn't work on it. Yeah, I think so it didn't get any music. The old rock and roller carts, so they've just like repainted them rather than got new ones. Yeah. So all the speakers are a bit dodgy, so we didn't hear anything. But it is an excellent ride. It's amazing. I loved it. Right, are we going on web slingers or are we getting food now? We'll see what the rest of the group wants to do, but we're getting pissed. Yeah. Okay, so as you exit the um, Avengers Campus, we've got this a super diner. Apparently, we're going in here for some shawarma. We've been recommended it. So, shawarma in a pitta, salads, cookies, a bit of everything again. I mean, this is cool. It looks like an American diner, motorhome sort of thing. Hello. Hi. Hello. Oh, wow. Look at this. So we're just in the super diner. I think we might get a shawarma to share. So we're all sat around this diner area and you can sort of make them watch them making it behind. It's pretty cool sat here. And then there's a real diner vibe in here. Right, so Vicky was going to order a kid shawarma just because we're going to eat loads and we wanted a small portion. But Vicky? Please just try to order one and you can't order one unless you're a child. I don't know what difference it makes. No. So we ordered a full size one and cut it in half. It's actually got 650 now instead of 7. So they're making less out of us. Okay, so ours has arrived. God, that looks well good. Mm -mm. I'm not really even sure what. Veal, is it? Yeah, I'll try it. Tracy, yours looks nice. So this is the vegan one. And we're going half so that I can eat more. It's not nice. 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 It's Five out of ten for me. Need a bit more, a bit of sauce on it, but it was good. Ten. A nine. I won't have that again. Vegan one. Shocking. I don't want to try the vegan. Just stole a bit of theirs. Not for me. And I don't yeah. like hummus. It tastes very nice. Nah, we ditched that one. Could do with garlic meal rather than something. Definitely. We need to try something else because we didn't enjoy that that much. Oh, we're going to stack for a pudding now. And you can have a spank. Pasta and bolognese. So that super diner is literally on the edge of uh, the America, the Avengers campus. God, I can't get my words right. Anyway, it's on the edge. So we're going back in, because I think we want to go to the Stark, it's not called Cafe, what's it called? Stark Factory. Stark Factory. So I want to get the bolognese and pasta. And that's why we shared. Some white chocolate and caramel dessert thing that I quite fancy as well. Yeah, and we also all want to go on Web Slingers, so we'll do one then the other. <laughs> Look at this Avengers car. Wow. With Iron Man on it. That is just amazing. <laughs> awesome. Amazing. And that's just come out right next to the Stark factory. I want to beat him. <laughs> she does love Iron Man so much. So this Stark factory has got pizza pasta. So I wanted to come in and to try this uh, bolognese pasta. There's all sorts. Oh, that's the, Vic the dessert Vicky wants to try. So there's a good selection on here. So just inside this um, stuff factory is this massive Iron Man. Amazing. So there's what we're after on that screen. So in here you've got the pastas on the end, pizzas. Nice size slice actually if you don't want to overdo it. I've got my bolognese pasta. Uh, Vic's got a thunder cake, so looking forward to these. We've also got a selection of salads as well in here. All pre-ready made for you. So all that was 18 euros. Don't think that's too bad. Massive portion. No, thank you. Right, so I'm gonna try. Okay. Right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's like a caramel Ooh. The caramel's a bit like in a roller yogurt. 
Simple. I like it. Oh, it's quite nice. Not as good as Donald. Not as good as Donald. But it's nice. It's a bit like a Rolo yogurt. Right, Emma, what do you think? Not straight Much better than Schwammer. Um, 9 out of 10. Really, really tasty. And really big portion, actually. Worth the money, definitely. So the verdict on that was really enjoyable. It was a massive portion, so if there's two of you, you can share that easily. But I left a little bit to make room for some pudding that I do need at some point. We haven't had enough sweet stuff yet today. So I think we're going to go on to Web Slingers now. Maybe RC races and then head on out of this park in, back into Disneyland and get some more eating and rides done. So 40 minutes is the normal line and then 15 minutes for single rider. So it's worth it if you don't mind being apart. So this is the holding room where you have like a free show before you go in. Uh, it's really immersive down there. It tells you what you've got to do through the ride, basically. So I'm in the single rider queue. I mean, Vicky have been split up. Obviously, we're in the single rider queue. That's going to happen. But I miss my wife. I don't like going home without her. She should come out of here any time from that pre-show at any point. Hopefully she does. So in that side, you've got the normal queue queuing. And then on this side, the single riders meet at the end and then join where there's space. So we've been split up. The five of them are through there. With Faith's pass, they get five of them. There's Vicky! She's re we're reunited! Just staying with the access pass, Faith gets to go on with four other people. So every now and then we do like the single rider or like two go on and then like I said five have gone on so it's always a race to see is single rider there or is the access pass. We got like, split up. Worth it. They let two groups in like in front of me and I was just like I want to be reunited with my wife. She's back. I'm back. <laughs> Ready for web slinging. So I'm not really sure how it works, but you're in this sort of like carpet, and it must have sensors above it. You've got to sling your wrist out and see it demonstrate it. And, um, and there must be sensors all around you for it to pick up where your wrists are throwing. And you've got to basically aim for them side of things. Sorry, I yeah, don't know. Web slinging, robot things, and save, save the, save the universe or whatever it is. Campus, that's the one. As you can tell, a terrible name. So yeah, you got to save the campus, and, and um, yeah, that's how you get scored. The more you hit, the more score you get. It's a very clever system how it sort of picks up above you. Right, we can take real note this time because last time I vlogged it on my wrist, so this time I didn't get a good score. So this score time, matters. yeah. So if you want to see the footage, tune into the other day where I yes. vlogged it. Yeah. So you sat in this like cart and like there's both sides to each of it. Clever how it works. Shut up and then they go. Next one loads. So we've been just over 25 minutes. I don't think it always pays off going on the single rider queue. No, it did say 15 minute queue time, so yeah. we're over that. Um, it, the, if it's eight per vehicle, four either side. So fingers crossed we get on to it. Oh my god. That web singer is exhausting. That was really good that I enjoyed it. I'm certainly out of breath. I mean, you know me, I'm so competitive. It reminds me of Toy Story Mania, I love it. What score did you get? So I got 227100. 243900 I got. Oh, that was close. I still beat you. Well done, well done. that's much better than last time. That's, bit, that's good for me, that. Yeah, I loved it. My arms oh, are aching. It's raining. Lovely. So, we're back inside the, the kind of hub bit as you walk into Hollywood, uh, Disney Studios. And then there's a little quick service cafe of drinks and snacks. And they have some group co shaped cookies in here. I don't know if you can see them on the menu, they're just up there. So there's two flavours, so I'm going to get one of each to try. But the main quick service that does burgers and stuff is right behind it. So I'll show you the cookies when I get them. But here's a look at the rest of the menu. And there's the cookies. So that's it, we're heading out of Walt Disney Studios for this trip, but it has been amazing, loved it. 
But now we're heading on over to the park to do some more rides and eat some more food. It's the last time Vicky were coming in. A little bit, yeah. It doesn't matter what park you're in at all, the castle's still there and I still love it. I might love Florida a bit more, but this one is beautiful. So on Main Street they've got the stall here where you can buy the champagne. So it's a, a glass that you can take away with champagne in, but it's 20 euros for one glass of champagne. Got Casey's Corner there, and just to the right, there's always a meet and greet here. Ah, today it's Stitch, 9:30 till two o'clock. So we're just on the Molly Brown, which is the same as like Liberty Bell. Yeah. Um, the best house. And this goes off every 20 minutes, all the way up to five o'clock. It's quite a pretty little tour around Thunder Mountain, which is just not on. They refurb it while we're here. We've not been here in like five, six years. Excellent. And. We're here and it's closed. I've got it shut. Yeah, it's, it's, it's probably one of my favourite rides. But you get a great view of Phantom Manor and, and that if it was working. And it's just a beautiful little scenic trip, trip this, isn't it? Yeah, we'll just have to come back. We will. Yeah. Life is a winding road. No telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even So Phantom Manor, we're gonna have a little go at this because it's only a five minute way and it is a classic amazing ride however as we've come on you've got mickey over there and it looks like it's like phantom mickey oh that's well cool which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out <laughs> Spur Steakhouse. It's so it smells amazing outside, very barbecue it smells. So it's a set menu one. So adults 35 for starter main or main dessert, and a starter main and dessert is 45 euros. Kids menu there, same set one, 25 euros. It's not a bad price really, but the only problem with these is you have to sit early because they close at five o'clock. Right, so I've come in to get a cake. I'm thinking, oh, this mini biscuit looks good. I'm thinking I want one of them cookies and one to take home, a Minnie Mouse and a Mickey Mouse cake pot. And I believe in here you can get the meringues, which Vicky wants. So here I found the meringues as well. Oh, they've got little like different pictures on each one. And they are f buy five, get one free, 11 euros. Awesome. Oh, chocolate spread in the Mickey Mouse one. What have you got, dear? Oh, what haven't I got? So, I brought cookie, six uh, macarons, 
Mickey um, ones are all chocolate filled and there's one salted caramel, Mickey and Castle. Not just one for Mickey, but one flavour he likes. I've got a Mickey cake pop, a mini cake pop. We tried the mini before, but you ate the ear, so I didn't get to try the ear. So, you know, the ice and tight taste different. I needed both. And another cookie. These are not all for now, so I might take one home. Where's my meringue? Oh, they don't do mine anymore, I'm sorry. Rubbish, I saw them the other day. No, you didn't. Go back and have a look, it's marshmallow. And I've got crock for sure, but I'm halfway through it. So, I've just got to the middle of the cookie. And it's got a chocolate layer in the middle. Good. Another 10 out of 10 cookie. So on Main Street, there's a little like alleyway up here where you've all sat at the back. It's quite handy for seating actually. It's all protected from the rain, so it's good. Most of it is anyway. So we just went into our own separate restaurants because we all wanted different things and then met up. So it's a good little meeting point there. I might have brought two cookies, two cake pops and six macaroons. However, or macarons. However, I only ate one cookie. I'm not a pig. Despite what you might think. I do eat a lot, I know, but yeah, I, I'm hoping to save something for the aeroplane and take one back. Probably they won't get back to England. I'll probably eat them before I get back or in the room tonight, but I've not eaten all that right now. No, anyway. I, I just had my pop for sure. Well, I didn't even eat it, all of it. No, she couldn't manage it. No, because it was a bit too cheesy at the end. I didn't think it would make me feel a little bit sick. Yes. Uh, I need to save some room for more. I'm not sure what more, but we'll see. So we're off to Hyperspace Mountain now. We've let our food settle a little bit. Yeah, we've had sat and chat. Uh, so yeah, we are needing to get to Space Mountain. No, hyperspace, hyperspace mountain. mountain. Right, so in Discovery Land, how beautiful is this? I mean, I keep saying the word beautiful, but really, everything is just beautiful. So we just queued up in hyper hyperspace mountain queue, and as we got to the next ones going on. It stopped down for technical difficulties and then like 10 minutes later they kicked us all off and said sorry the ride's closed. So we've got we've got given a fast pass for free. However we go tomorrow and it's near nearly the end of the day so a low chance we're gonna get back on it. I'm a bit gutted because I was really excited about that. But these things happen, can't control that. So I'm not sure what we're gonna do next. I'll keep you updated. So we just popped in the Star Wars shop and this lounge fly is in the sale and it is 27 euros. I wish I liked Star Wars because that is just unreal price. So in the shops they do have like sale sections everywhere. So it's worth keeping an eye out for. So it was Star Traders we were just in and uh, I think Nick and Lee aren't happy with us because we make them spend money. Not wrong with that, every day is best. So we're just going to leave the park, I think Emma wants to go to the Emporium first. Just a last bit of shopping before we leave. And then we're going to go to Sequoia Lodge, I think. Go have a look around there, sit down, have a drink. Just chill out, just chill out. I think we've done everything we wanted to now and we've made the most of it. Yeah. I'm not sure if we're going to come back for the drone show later. Just uh, depends, honestly. We'll yeah, it just depends. However, we've had the like a best day so far, so head on out and go and relax for a bit. Because it's getting a little bit cold. A little. And my feet can do with a rest. Oh. It's amazing in Florida how for two weeks we can just go non stop. And on day three, here, I'm wiped out. I don't know, I think the weather here, because it's colder and being wrapped up. Yeah, and like we haven't that. got our crocs on, our crocs are like help. Yeah. So, I'm gonna go off to Sequoia. We'll see you there. See what else we can buy on the way. Okay, we're having a quick pit stop in McDonald's. Absolutely gigantic. It's just off the main uh, village, Disney Village, not far at all. So you've got Rainforest Cafe there, that's the back. And behind it's this McDonald's. And I believe there's a chocolate hazelnut burger you can get in here. That's all I've come in for. We'll see if it's there. Oh, I see it on a picture, it's there. So inside this McDonald's, a muck cafe. And on it is what we've come in for. The Choco Nuts. The hazelnut Nutella burger. I have to get one to try. So that's the burger we're going to get. 
Yeah, yeah that's what we're getting. Did but it's just get on. No, it'll be melted. All oh, right, okay. And then, oh, look at them donuts. Chocolate donuts. The cookies look amazing. Apple pie. Muffin. I'm not hungry though. Macarons. Stripey In donuts. McDonald's. Cookies. So we just ordered our milk chocolate, uh, two of them, uh, one coffee medium and the chocolate ring donut, I think, for the boys, 10 20 That is just great value compared to the park. This McDonald's is massive, it's got a uh, big upstairs here. So uh, yeah, good Good if you don't want to spend too much in the park. Good addition. Let's see what this milk chocolate's going to be like. Apparently messy, but I am excited for this. Right, so we've just been to McDonald's and we've got Emma, the chocolate nuts. So I watched them do it so I could tell you. I know I've ate enough, but... So it's like a brioche bun, warmed up, and then they put Nutella on the bottom, and then hazelnuts, and then they stick this big chocolate coin on the top. And then stick it together. So it's a bit of a melted mess. There you go. That looks amazing. It better be as good as I hope it's going to be. What, what have you got for us? I'm a pancake. What's your point? Pancake! Watch out, it's got chocolate in the middle. Oh my god. Oh my god. They got rid of them in the UK, haven't they? It's a pancake sandwich. Mm. That is good. It's like 220, mm. something like that. Absolutely nothing. Oh my god. Oh. Mm. So the middle's not melted, so it's a chocolate block. It's amazing. You must get this. I got chocolate dough. Mm. 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 So the verdict is, could have been more melted because the chocolate block inside is solid. But I suppose if it was more melted, it'd be a mess. Ah. Absolutely amazing. So glad I got it. Donuts. It's a bit like the ones you can get outside of the chocolate little. Yeah, good. I didn't try it. I've eaten so much this trip. I did not actually need this. It was so good. No, but we're off on Florida diet when we get home, so it begins tomorrow. Well, no, Monday. So we can eat as much as we can for So just come in to look at the, the value of it in here, but two big max with fries and a drink is 13.50 two fillet of fish 12.80 that one so excellent value really so a big mac meal over there is 8.80 just for one rather than this double one like the value of this is brilliant just compared to like the park value if you wanted to know really good right i know i've said it already but that was amazing thank you mcdonald's so I think now we're going to go over to Sequoia Lodge and sit and chill. Unless there's something else that distracts me on the way. Right, so here's a Disney Village strip and McDonald's is literally there. So it is just off the main strip. Right next to the steakhouse, you just take a turn in. So we've got the big balloon, Newport Bay on the right, Marvel New York Hotel on the left, and then in the middle is Sequoia Lodge, which we've never been to before, so it'd be nice to have a little look around. The best thing about Disney Paris is this, the U. It's just everywhere in general, it's just so pretty. So pretty. I think 100% me and Vicky will stay in that one next time we come. And here's Sequoia Lodge. I know nothing about this hotel. It looks absolutely beautiful. You're massive, absolutely massive. So there's Hunter's Grill as soon as you come in. Oh wow! And there's a bear. Oh, Beaver Creek, so another restaurant down there. Right, so there's a wilderness theme in here. I found a bear. Oh! Another bear next to her. And then the reason we've came in is because there's like a really nice lounge sort of area. There's a fireplace there, I wish it was going, but we're all gonna go sit, get a drink, and relax around one of the booths in there. This hotel is absolutely beautiful. So we're at the Redwood, Redwood Bar and Lounge. God, look at this. Like, that's absolutely huge, that area. There's seven of us. So uh, that is perfect. I wish that fire was going there. That'd be really nice to sit around right now. We've just come into Sequoia Lodge shop while we're here. Look what we found. 
It's white Pluto. He's like a baby, like oh, really he's pale amazing. yellow. Amazing. He's like a baby, kind of. That is adorable. Oh, Love that. Have you seen anything else you like in here? Oh, we've got a key ring each. Ah, you found them. So I've just found this Disney lounge fly. It's beautiful. But I'm resisting buying any more bags while I'm here. I do love this snuddy though, still. So apart from finding Pluto, which looked a bit different, and this Minnie Mouse suitcase, which is 140 euros, absolutely massive. I absolutely love it, it's beautiful. But I've got enough suitcases, and this beanie. Apart from that, like everything else is just the same in here. Great shop, but it's all the same, isn't it? We sat back in the bar and we reevaluated our decision. He's coming home with us. So it was 26 euros, but we stole Nick and Lee's annual pass and got discount, so it made it 22 euros. So Pluto's coming home with us. I have no idea where I'm going to put him, but I just couldn't stop thinking about it after I left the shop, so I had to go home with him. It's just something like I've not seen before this colour. I absolutely love it. I mean, in this light, it's quite yellow, but it's quite pale in real life. I love it. Like, it's so soft. So like, I, um, yeah, I had to go home So, we are done here at Sequoia Lodge. That was a really nice, relaxing drink, weren't it? Just yeah, it was really chilled in there. I like the uh, the vibe of it. Yeah, so we're gonna head back on over to the, well, we're gonna go to the sports bar. Tracy, Neil and Faith are gonna get comfy, get us a table. And me, Nick and Lee and Vicky are just gonna head back in to see the drone show. We're just gonna go into the park, we get to the back, just so we can see the drone show and then get back out. Yeah, we're not gonna watch the main fireworks because it's not, not it that great. It won't particularly that well, great. The drone, drone show is unreal. So we'd like to go and see that once more. And then we're all gonna come back out, meet in the sports bar and get some Mickey shaped pizzas, I think, aren't we? Oh, I don't think I want a hot dog. Anyway, we will see. I mean, not that we need to eat more today, but it is the last day, so we're just making up for what we'll not be in here the next for a while. Months. Oh, yeah, diet starts on Monday. Yeah. I need to diet. I feel like I'm ready to explode. Yeah, I do. And we need to get body ready for Turkey soon, but Florida at the in September. So, uh, diet begins Monday. Anyway, let's go over to the sports bar. Well, we might buy some more merch later. Yeah, well, we'll we haven't been into the fashion shop. Or the Lego or shop. Or the Lego shop, which is next door to the sports bar. So, um, yeah, no, she's just told me that she's got 45 euros in her pocket left. I just cash. Found them there. So we need to spend it, don't we? Possibly. We will. Right, so we've just come out of uh, Sequoia. Look at this for a view. I mean, I'm not going to get bored of this whatsoever. And the Marvel Hotel. Absolutely stunning. To get into the Disney Village, you've got the security. And it's also the same with the park. So check your bags, pockets. It's a standard check everywhere. So we've got about six minutes till the drone show starts. It is mental busy. It's like six minutes to go and it, we're at the gates trying to get in. Mad. I don't know if we'll make it in time. All right, so we made it through the gates with like three minutes to spare till the drone show. Oh, it's not actually busy back here. So I don't know why the crowds are that bad in there. Right, we might be right at the back for the drone show, but this means we can escape when it's done because we're not watching the next show. Really good view. I've not got no one tall in front of me. This should be good. 1992, a magical parade celebrating the legacy of Walt Disney sparkled to life, bringing joy and imagination. Today, the parade returns.
Another saw it again. Yeah, that drone show is amazing. This is just like nothing, nothing else really I've ever seen before. I'm really gutted we didn't get to see the Marvel one. I don't think they do that in the studios part of uh, I do feel though, Dizzy's missing a trick with that one because as nice as it was and amazing as it was, like it's a dragon I'm seeing above the castle. Why aren't they seeing like Mickey Mouse? Yeah, we need a Mickey on there. It's missing like the Disney characters. But then it, that's the original uh, like, grid. Oh, is it? Yeah. Anyway, magical. Stunning. So we, we've done that in there. Now we're going to head on over to the sports bar where Tracy, Neil, and Faith are, and we're all going to go and get Mickey shaped pizzas, I think. Yeah. So we went to the back this time, just in Main Street. We went in just to see that show and back out. But we were stood right at the back, and I saw more from there than I did at the front. There was no fighting for space. It was just, it was a great spot. Yeah, it was so much better at the back. Yeah, so if we do that again, yeah. I'm just going to go to the back again. Really good spot. Yeah, you that. see loads more. And the view down Main Street, there's like, you can see the projections and stuff down there. It's really worth Yeah, and we walked in like two, three minutes before it started. So yeah. no need to queue for an hour right at the front. Just and then to you're see. not getting shoved around either. No, it was a great spot. Yeah, it's loads better. Right, so we're at the sports bar. This is awesome. So again, this is just on Disney Village. But yeah, we're gonna go meet the guys in here and get some dinner. So this is the sports bar. Ooh, smells good. We're all American themed in here. Absolutely love it. As you can tell, I absolutely love everything. Here they are. Okay, so Vicky has got hot dog and fries. And I've got a Mickey shake pizza. Oh, it smells amazing. Are you jealous? You can have an ear. How is my pizza, Vicky? Hot dog? That pizza's like 10 out of 10. Amazing. It's a nice relaxed vibe in this sports bar. Loved it. So we're just popping into Disney Fashion. We haven't been there yet. And then next door is the Lego shop. There's got to be something in here, isn't there? I hope so. So here's the uh, top I like, Vicky. I still really like that. That's cool. It's lovely, isn't it? I've got a feeling we're going to find a few bits in here. Ooh. Really nice t-shirt. I like that one. Oh, me and Vicky can have matching. Oh, I like that one. So that's one I like. I think she likes that one. Lovely. Ah, my wife wanted a new phone case. I think I might have found one. They are 45 euros though, but they're like a military grade, like protection case. So they're meant to be pretty good these, but 45 euros, is it worth it? I'll ask her. Okay, so apparently it is worth it, but they don't have the, the size, I've got the iPhone right size. 14 or 13 Pro, and they don't have the Pro. It's only iPhone 13, 14, not the Pro. Sorry, wife. I've not seen this spirit jersey in any of the shops, or if I have, I've not paid any attention. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Love that. Oh, they've got Encanto ears as well. Oh, little suitcase is nice. Nice stuff in here. So I've not seen this Peter Pan spirit jersey. That's pretty cool. And this Peter Pan shirt. Some unique stuff in this fashion shop. I love it. So there's an awesome selection of t-shirts here. So the patterns are across the top and the t-shirts are underneath. I think really love some of these and they are all let's have a look they're all 23 euros i don't think that's too bad so i've just seen this lion king t-shirt in here so i'd seen the spirit jersey which may i add is amazing however i've not seen this one in the park so there's definitely in this fashion shop more in here than i've seen in the park yeah worth coming into isn't it yeah definitely so in the fashion shop here, there's a service where you can print on your own t-shirts. So you've got little machines here and they'll print them in the shop. So it's a pretty good service. There's a, a big selection here of um, items you can look through. And that's like the, the, the denim jackets, t-shirts, hoodies, zip jumpers. So you can like see here what size you are and then get your pattern printed on them. 
So it's pretty good service really. This new Disney Wish merch is beautiful. I've not seen the movie yet, but I will. Oh, look at you. I'm not sure how you wear a beret. <laughs> Harry, the mini mask beret. So we go. <laughs> How's it look? French. <laughs> Right, so we're off into the Lego shop. Vicky's a big Lego collector. She's just not done any for a while. Wow. That is amazing. Built out of Lego. Love it. So I'm really good at killing flowers. Or they just don't last long in my house because I like a hot house. So Vicky brought me once some flowers, which I've got in a vase made of Lego. But I've just found these. I love them. So she collects the Lego sets, builds them, loves it. We've got a moved house so she had a Lego room. Whereas I've just got a few little like flowers around the house made of Lego. So Vicky, I, I like this if you're watching. At home I've got these, uh, is it tulips? that Love them. And I believe I've got this set at home. This is the one I've seen that I love. I've got the sunflowers. I don't have them. I think they're roses. Lotus. And little roses are cool. They're really cute. I love them. Okay, so wifey's seen something. What have you found? This. I love that. It's got a Lego wall. Oh, wow. Are you finally going to buy yourself something? I just don't know if I get it home that rich in the box. Do you... I, I don't like to push the boxes because I like to keep them. Can't you just carry that on the plane with you? It's about time you bought yourself something. And you want to get back into your Lego because you've not done it in a while. You've been too busy working. It's January, quiet a time. Anyway, I don't have to convince you. I'm going to buy it for you if you don't buy it. <laughs> so just in case you're curious, the one Vicky found is 99 euros. So we've got this castle at home. Massive, this one. This giant Mickey build out of Lego and the brick next to it. That is just awesome. If she could have that in the house, she would. Wouldn't you, dear? Yeah, you wouldn't. <laughs> so there's a really small, cute version of the castle. It's 39.99. Vicky got that in Disney World. I love it. That whole wall is made out of Lego, absolutely ginormous. So Vicky, did you find any Lego you wanted? And why aren't you leaving with it? Hmm. My wife is in big, big trouble. She won't take no for an answer and she's gone to the desk. I've tried to take the box out of her hand about three times. She won't take no for an answer. I've tried to make all the excuses up in the world. She won't have any of them, even though they're valid. But no, she insists on treating me. So thank you very much, wife. I do love you, but you're in trouble and you're very naughty. Purchase made! Yeah. Thank you, naughty wife. Happy wife, though, eh? Did you want it? Yes, you did. And you never treat yourself. Nope, you work so hard all the time and you never treat yourself. You always try and treat me, but it's nice to treat you. Anyway. We're just heading on out of the Disney Village now, back to the hotel. Dinner was lovely. The guys are already headed back because Vicky and me just can't stop shopping. <laughs> I think we've shopped them all out to be honest, yeah. I think the sick of us shopping now. <laughs> yeah, so we're just all the way back to the buses. Gonna head back to the, uh, probably just sit in the, the bar area, just chill and chat for a little bit longer with everybody before getting a good night's sleep for travelling home tomorrow. Oh, we need to pack. Long. Nah, well, anyway, right. Let's hope there's a bus and it's, we're not all having to fight to get on this one. Oh, I'm just kind of sad we're leaving. Oh, I am. It's been a really magical time, hasn't it? Yep. But we'll be in Disney soon. Yes. Back in our happy place of Walt Disney World. I mean, it don't get no better than that, does it? We've literally just walked up and it has pulled up. I think we got a bit lucky there, didn't we, dear? Really lucky. We are back after another wonderful day in Disneyland Paris. It has been another great day. Yeah. Absolutely loved every second. I am absolutely stuffed. I've eaten 
absolutely everything. I feel like I'm pregnant. But I'm ready to explode. Yes. I'm almost glad it's over so I can stop eating. Yeah, but you've still got all them snacks in your bag. Well, obviously I've got to take some home. I need some for the aeroplane tomorrow. The aeroplane's only an hour. Well, airport. Let's get stuffing. <laughs> I will, don't you worry. <laughs> anyway, oh dear. thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this last full day with us. We are back tomorrow with the travel day home. So please join us for home day. Yes. If you want to like, comment and subscribe. And we'll see you tomorrow for travel day home. Good, Good night. night. I know I messed it up, but in my soul.